Hi, Will from Music Tech here at the AES convention in New York with Ryan from Axis Analog. Ryan, how are you doing? Doing excellent, thank you. Excellent. And Axis Analog is a new service, correct? Correct. This is the first time ever you can access analog hardware in the cloud from anywhere. So you use our plugin to control remotely, robotically controlled analog hardware. So you can see right now I'm cycling between presets on the pair of distressors and the robotics are adjusting. If I turn knobs on the plug-in, it's controlling all of the hardware. So what you're going to do from your studio is you're going to open up this plug-in just like any other plug-in, and you're going to stream audio from your digital audio workstation out to our hardware. You're using the plug-in to control the robotics. The robotics are synced with the audio in real time. We have cameras on the meters, so you get the metering in real time. So everything is all synced up. Okay, so this is real analog processing. Correct. You send your audio to your processors. Right, so our, our rack actually lives in Longmont, Colorado. And so we okay. have a rack full of hardware, all fitted with these robotics. And what sort of uh, latency can one expect if you're, you send your audio out? How long does it take to come back? That's a good question. So it's user selectable, depending on the quality of your internet connection. So if you have a good internet connection, you can get it down to about 300 milliseconds. Mm -hmm. If you have a slower one, you can go to 2,500 milliseconds. We also offer the ability to compress the audio. So you can go lossless uncompressed 2448, uh -huh. or you can choose to compress the audio, and then when you've got everything set the way you want it, you can render it offline at full resolution. OK, so walk me through it then. I've got this plugin up in my DAW, right? right. I want to put my audio through a distressor, mm -hmm. say. Um, so I put this on. At, at what time can I do this? Do I have to book a slot? How does it work? Yeah, exactly. That's the, the thing that everybody always asks us. So of course, it's real analog gear. So we can't have multiple users through a box at a time. Sure. So each piece of equipment is, is reservable, and you pay by the time that you reserve it. Eventually, we'll be offering a subscription option. But for now, it's just pay as you go per box. And you, you can any time, you can plug in. You can connect to our server, and it'll show you what's available. And you just click on what you want, and it'll take you to our reserve page. And then you can reserve the equipment. OK, and how much is this going to cost then? Because I mean, some of these pieces of gear are not necessarily available to the bedroom producer. Right. So that's exactly the value equation here is that, for example, you could plug into, say, the SSL G comp and then hit a pair of Pultex. That's $12,000 of hardware. It's going to cost you about $30 an hour to rent it. And so you you get feedback of what you're what you're changing within the plugin and it's being changed in real yep, all in, in the real, real time. in IRL as they say yeah yeah, yeah. Right. <laughs> okay and then you hear it back okay and then you can commit your changes at the end of a session yep and so you have two options you could you can make a new track and just print it live right into that track uh -huh. you can use your DAW's bounce function in real time or we have an offline processor that uploads the file runs it through the gear and then downloads it to you to help you if you have a slower internet connection. OK, let's see it move again then, shall we? Oh, of course, yeah. Robots. Thanks very much, Ryan. You're welcome. Cheers. Thanks.